and welcome to another YouTube video on YouTube slash home edition. In this video, I had a problem with my computer. Basically, I just heard the CPU fan. It was running almost at full speed and I really wasn't doing much. I did have something called a VMware running, which allows me to run a virtual computer uh, within my computer. And I was running a Windows XP machine and on that machine I was downloading something with a program called uTorrent and like I said there wasn't much really happening on my computer besides that so what I started doing is I, I opened up task manager okay and I also put my motherboard information software kind of like side by side you know task manager and the motherboard utility so I can monitor the temperature and what I wanted to do is basically pick processes and kill them and to see if my temperature would drop within a few seconds of killing the process. That way I would identify, you know, which process was causing the problem. So, I mean, I killed a lot of processes trying to figure out what the hell was going on. And if you look at your task manager, there's a little checkbox on the bottom. It says show processes from all users. Well, I had to I had to select that checkbox um, because the process I wanted to kill is called VMNAT-EXE, and it's a type of networking uh, utility for VMware, where it allows it to use my physical network card on the virtual computer. It uses some kind of network address translation things I don't really know exactly what it does I do know it was causing a major issue on my computer and you could see that the utility was showing me that uh, you know my CPU temperature was at 50 degrees Celsius which is abnormal when my computer's at idle usually it's around like 38 degrees Celsius so I killed that process uh, a few times and then respawned itself so uh, I killed all the VMware processes and then I killed that process and that fixed that problem. I will be making another video showing you how to um, stop VMware from using that network process and you know going crazy with the resources. So I researched this and this seems to happen only like with Windows 7 and I think Windows Vista machines so it's not affecting other um, operating systems. But like I said, I'll make a new video on how to fix the VMware taking too much resources by changing the network settings. But in this video, I mean, basically what I wanted to show you is if you hear your CPU fan running really loud and you don't really have much running, or maybe you do have some stuff running, what you want to do is use like a utility that shows you your CPU temperature and maybe your CPU fan speed. And it, it also, um, <clears throat> on the other side, you want to put your task manager and do pretty much what I'm doing in this video, you know, selecting processes that might be allocating a lot of memory or CPU resources and basically select the process and end the process. And I mean, once you kill the right process, I mean, you will see your, your CPU temperature will start dropping like pretty much right away. So, I mean, that's a, I mean, as you can see here, I just killed that process and my temperature did drop, you know, and that's exactly what I wanted to demonstrate in this video. And, you know, if you have a problem like this, go ahead and shoot me a comment and I'll try to help you out as well. Take care. If you like videos like this, go ahead and visit my channel, YouTube slash Home Edition, and subscribe.